Some of our departing contestants will receive some of the following top security padlocks from Slaymaker locksmiths since 1888. Only Slaymaker padlocks have a strength rating that you match to your security needs. Also, Cortade Hydrocortisone for safe, effective relief of itching, rashes, and skin irritations. Remember, Cortade Hydrocortisone. Plus, relaxing at home, drink sparkling pink champagne any day when you feel special. Tastes like bubbly wine. Pink champagne malt liquor from Iroquois brands. Also, Rain Dance Car Wax actually outlasts leading dealer applied poly wax. Water beating proves it. DuPont guarantees it. Thank you, Jay. Three hundred dollars in the pot. Before we start, though, before we continue the match and move back to Eric for his next election, Doug, your wife is in the audience, right? That's right. I just wondered if we might uh, meet her right quick, like sure. if she would hold up her hand. Is she the lady in green, Doug? That's right. What's sure. her name? Her name is Sue. Do you have any children? <laughs> no, we don't. How long have you been married? Uh, let's see. It was a, it was a year in June. Yeah. Yeah. You don't have any children yet. Right. <laughs> hey, nice to see you with us. Thank you for lovely lady, Doug. Thank you. Lovely lady, and I'm sure she's pulling for you. Yeah. All right, right Doug, so. Eric, take a look at the board again. Let's shuffle and move back to you, Eric. There they are. I'd like to try one word names in the bottom right, please. All righty, here's the question on one word names for you, Eric. The title character in Victor Hugo's The Hunchback of Notre Dame works as a bell ringer in the cathedral. What is his one word name? Quasimoto. Good, that's right. Put it up there in one word names and let's shuffle again. $500 pot, Doug. Doug Lansky. Uh, let's see, I think I'll try redheads again, Wink. All right. Question. In 1980, auburn-haired actress Tanya Roberts replaced Shelley Hack as lady detective in this popular television series. I want you to name the show. Charlie's Angels. You got it. That's right. Put a next there. An O goes in that spot, and we do a quick shuffle. $700 pot now, Eric. Redheads to block, please. Yeah, three times in the category. Eric for a block. This red-headed British politician was in Missouri in 1946 when he said, an iron curtain has descended and coined a new phrase for a block. Name him. Winston Churchill. Correct. Put an X there for a block. Let's shuffle again. $900 pot, Doug. Okay, I think I'm going to try potluck picks, Wink. Potluck pictures it is. Doug, take a look at this picture, please. This church choir, which is based in Salt Lake City, has been performing for over 100 years. Name the choir. That's the Mormon Tabernacle Choir. Right. Another O on the board. Bottom left corner. 200 in the pot. Four boxes are left. Four boxes. $1,100 pot. Let's move them all around. Eric. Uh, Toms and Tims to block, please. Toms and Tims for a block. You have constantly been on the defensive in this game, it seems, mm -hmm. Eric. Here's your question for a diagonal block of Doug. This Thomas is one of America's most famous authors. His works include Look Homeward Angel, and you can't go home again. For a block, name this Thomas. It's Thomas Wolfe. Right. You did it. Diagonal block on the board. Another $200 in the pot. Takes it to 1300 Three boxes remaining. The categories in them will determine the fate of the game, so let us move them around. Doug? I'm going to try potluck picks against Wing. Top center. Again, I ask you to take a look at this picture, Doug. This 1969 smash hit told the tale of two motorcyclists searching for America. Name it. That's Easy Rider. It is Easy Rider. You'll ride again for another O. Top center. $1,500 in the pot. Two boxes left. The categories that show up will decide what happens to you. No doubt about that in this game. Let's move them. Move them out, and there they are. U.S. history and royalty, Eric. I think I'll try royalty to block, please, Wink. For a vertical block in the center of the board, answer this, Eric, and we will have a block as well as a tie game. And here is the question on royalty. This Russian monarch who was married to Alexandra, was the last czar to rule Russia. He abdicated his throne during the revolution of 1917. For a tie, name him. Nicholas. Yes, that's right, for a tie. Good tie match once again. You seem to have a penchant for ties, Eric. Yes. However, you have been winning those ties right along, too. What's going to happen between you and Doug? Time will tell. Ties will tell. $1,700 in the pot. We are going to show you nine new categories and get started all over again if you two are up to it. And they are. Here are the subjects. Famous sights, animal songs, heroes, villains, the stage, about words, rivers, ancient history, and sex symbols. Eric. I'll try famous sights in the upper left, please. Here's your question in the category of famous sights. Eric, first take a look at this famous site. Although it is now a museum, this theater in Washington, D.C. was once the site of an assassination of a president. Name the theater. That's the Ford's Theater. Correct. 
Ford's Theater, where Abraham Lincoln was assassinated. Put an X there. And we add another $200 to the pot, taking our pot to $1,900. Let's shuffle. Doug, the uh, record for ties on tic-tac-toe is seven. As you continue, let's see if you can break that record. What subject would you like? I'm going to go for about words in the middle wing. In the center, we're $300 to the pot. I'll describe two singing voices, and you tell me the word that names each voice. One, this word originally meant heavy tone and describes one of the lower male voices. I want you to name it. Now, secondly, this word means high and originally referred to the highest male voice. It's now used to describe the lowest female voice. I want you to name that. And I'll give you some seconds to think about it. Doug, once again, this word originally meant heavy tone and describes one of the lower male voices. Name it. Bass. Is that acceptable? No, it's not. No, we have baritone here. Baritone. And this word means high and originally referred to the highest male voice, now used to describe the lowest female voice. That would be alto. Alto. We'll be back in just a moment with more of Tic Tac Joe. Interested in celebrity couples who tattle on their spouses? Curious to hear their intimate tales? Well, do we have the show for you. On April 18th, get ready to play. We'll continue this match next show. For Tic Tac Doe, Wink Martindale, bye-bye. Some of our devoted contestants will receive some of the following. Raid Wasp and Hornet Killer have killed wasps and hornets in their nest from up to 12 feet away. Also, Deep Woods Off, the insect repellent that protects against extra tough mosquitoes and biting flies. Plus, Pledge gives your furniture a clean, clear, more beautiful shine. Try Pledge brings out the beauty every time you dust. Also, bake someone happy with new Betty Crocker Creamy Deluxe Cream Cheese Frosting. Enjoy this delicious new creamy cream cheese taste on all your favorite cakes. Plus, Enhance Instant Hair Conditioner. Oh, overworking your hair drains it of its natural moisturizers. Enhance puts moisturizers back. Enhance moisturizes overworked hair. Tic Tac Doe is a Jack Berry and Danny Wright production.